point clouds are set of points that put together in a 3D space. When they are stacked together, they represent a surface or an object, which could be facade, a building, or interiors of a space. In order to generate point clouds, in the industry, we use laser scanners. There are loads of laser scanners available right now, and what they do is those laser scanners scan the surface or the space by creating thousands of laser measurement and registering the data as a point cloud, which can go less than one millimeter accuracy. The different machines have different ranges, different quality, different amount of points that they can generate, and different levels of accuracy. If we compare the point clouds to a traditional means of measurement, where we measure everything by hand, whether the, like by hand surveys, imagine yourself doing a complicated terrain or existing historical building. How you will be able to generate all the data, all the inclined walls, all the details, all the complicated stuff that you will be facing because there will be certain things, especially if you have blueprints, you will see that they will not be matching because there were certain amendments during the years, as well as when there were arrangements during the construction stage, which we all know at the time they weren't recorded. So when you compare those blueprints and manual hand measurement, many things will not fall into the right the place. Point cloud allows us to bridge that gap. We see everything as realistically as possible. Once we see all the data, we can actually go next step, build a BIM model. BIM model allows us to create a digital information model that allows us to work, design, and document the renovation project. The renovation project will have multiple phases. It will have existing, demolition, new, temporary. If there are different stages as well, the construction it can be also include those stages. These all can be interpreted into one single BIM model. If you'd like to learn more about building information modeling, BIM, please click on this video. If you'd like to learn how an architect should use point clouds, please check this video. Don't forget to like, subscribe to our channel, because every week we're posting at least one video for you. Don't forget to turn your notification bells on.